I don't think I've ever just written a gradient in CSS from scratch. I've either like copied and pasted an existing gradient and played around it until I'm happy, or I've used a visual gradient editor to create the CSS text that I need. I can never remember the syntax for gradients because I don't write them that often. Because as you say, dialing in the right gradient is something you either do in text where you make a thousand micro adjustment or you use a gradient generator. There's a thousand of them online. I think everybody uses them when you want to make a gradient, right? So it's, it's kind of become the normal to use a visual tool for that. And then you copy in the CSS, right? So I don't think text is the right format for that. Like it's just not very good for building visual things because it's hard to visualize things based on their essentially instructions. At Nordcraft, we don't just use color pickers and gradients. We use visual editing for everything because you just get that instant feedback. You can see the changes as you make them. Any time where there's some uncertainty and you need to see it to dial it in, having a visual tool like that just makes everything so much easier.